Window and crossing selection. A window selection is when we select objects by making a rectangled selection window. We will only select things that are entirely within that rectangle. For example, I'm going to go up and erase some things. So I'm going to select erase. It says select objects. I'm going to pick here in the center of the circle. And then I'm going to drag a rectangle on it. I'm going to do what's called implied windowing. I'm going to make this implied window. An implied window means when I pick in the upper left and then when I pick in the lower right, it's going to create a window. That window is a blue shaded window. So notice I'm right now all them circles in the middle are selected, but the four circles on the outside are not selected because it's not entirely within the selection window. I'll pick and notice how all those uh, circles in the middle are selected but those four in the corners were not because it was not entirely within that window. I can hit enter and all those particular things were selected for its operation which is the erase command. All right. Now I'm going to undo that. Bring all those things back and let's try this again. Let's do a crossing selection. Now when I do a crossing selection anything that is touched by the crossing window will be selected. And so I'm going to go up and I choose Erase. And I'm going to come down and I'm going to pick this time, I'm going to use what's called Implied Windowing. I'm going to pick in the lower right and I'm going to drag it up to the upper left. This time it builds a green box and now it's selecting anything that it touches. So you notice it, it took all the ones in the center but it's also selecting the four round circles in the corners. So now all those circles are selected in this type and then I hit enter. So a window selection, everything must be inside of the box to be selected. A crossing selection, anything that touches the box is selected. When we do an applied windowing, anything that we pick from the upper left to the lower right is an implied window. Anything that we pick from the lower right to the upper left is an implied crossing.